guys, what's up? This is the paradiddle portion of the intermediate techniques videos. In this video, we're gonna learn about all different types of paradiddles because people always talk about the famous right, left, right, right, left, right, left, left paradiddle pattern. But on our top 40 chart of rudiments from Vic Firth or anywhere else, um, we have lots of different types of paradiddle rudiments. So let's learn them today. So the paradiddle that we actually learned is the full name for it is a single paradiddle because what we really have is a right, left, right, right, and that finishes out the paradiddle. And then the left, right, left, left is just the left-hand portion of a single paradiddle. What we can do with it though is we can combine the accent thing we just learned with this idea of paradiddles. So what we get is an accent right, left, right, right. Same sticking as a paradiddle, but we're just accenting the downbeat. Right, left, right, right, and then an accent on the left. Left, right, left, left. So what we end up with is an accent tap, 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 accent tap, tap, tap. Try it. So that's how you practice this. You start out really slow, really controlled, making sure your accents sound the same and your taps sound the same. That's a really important thing to think about. That's the single paradiddle. The double paradiddle, all it does is it adds an extra two strokes, two single strokes to the beginning of a paradiddle. So a double paradiddle goes right, left, right, left, right, right. Left, right, left, right, left, left. So we're just adding an extra two singles on each one. And we want to accent both of those because it gives it its own characteristic if we do that. Right, left, right, left. So an accent left, accent left. Right, right. Accent left, accent left, left, left. This is going to be a little bit different from what we're used to because we've been doing an accent followed by a tap. When in this case, the accent is going to be followed by another accent. So you almost have to do a rebound stroke versus a accent stroke followed by a tap. Honestly, it's best to just not think of it that way. In my opinion, it's best to think of it as accent tap, accent tap, tap, tap. Not a big deal, I don't think. Another way to think about the double paradiddle is para para diddle, para para diddle, para para diddle, para para diddle. Para para diddle. 